legendary best producer ever to ever ever touch a beat machine you already know live from headquarters dj primo your boy saigon we get it in baby i'll see I'll see you, but you come as no surprise. Please, please, please listen to my demo. What I spit is just a memo. Just an echo of my thoughts. Take a metro on this course and forget all that they talk. I'm going to tell you the real MO, the MO. Back in the days off the boulevard of Palm Brook, where I scribble in my first rhyme book. I took it to the pavement, right to my mother's basement. Kept a nice arrangement, a record plus the wise hook. Table and a mic, hip-hop 101 for a student of the game. Analog, no computer in my range. Catalog, crates of records, I will move them on a the train. Cats and dogs, if you rain, it's still I'm moving to the fame. Music bitch change, now it's respect, power, money. To make some quick change, gotta bounce out of the country. Cause the shit game is too crowded and muggy. Jump on a quick plane, look down, now they don't love me. Huh? So, I'll see you. But you come as no surprise. It's basic. Face it, if the underdog always the favorite, then when he make it, everyone gon' hate it. And everyone that loves it is related. And everyone related probably want a payment. Grandma want a facelift. I'm just trying to reach greatness and not get left naked. They said I did my thing, but I was wasted. Beat I just created, wrote a verse, erased it. But sent it out trying to get this placement. Is it art versus business, life versus entertainment? Friends turn enemies when there's no business arrangement. Distraction in the day forces me to do the grave shift and shape shift. Cause I don't wanna keep doing the same shit. I can't gauge it how they fake it till they make it. If perception is reality, it's easy to just stage it. If it's all a fantasy, how you gonna grade it? Call it a robbery, but to make it, you gotta take it. So, so, I'll see you. Come as no surprise. I'll see you. I see you square. Proud of you, my neck. Ain't surprised, though. I remember the day the guy he passed me some headphones. He said, Take a listen to this. His name's Graham Jones. He be killing his verses, giving him headstones. And yo, his beats is hotter than most red bones. I said, I got a link with this kid. Could you look him up? He said, I gave him unsigned hype. I hook it up. The same night, we was headed up to the Bronx to create some shit that make him get the fuck up like Pharaoh Monk. By the time we had got to our second bottle, we had recorded Color Purple, True Story, and Desperado. We had blunt spears, snares, and a lot of kicks. This is way before we knew about the politics that come with the game, the lanes and the riding dick. Yo, we just wanted to show that we had the hottest shit. Fast forward 10 years later, I'm fucking giddy. He got shit with Mariah and be clever with Diddy. I see you, Scram Jizzy. Jizzy. I see you. But you come as no surprise. DJ Premier. I see Thanks for tuning in to Antagonistic Radio. Tonight's guest is underground rapper k Reno. We'll be covering a few topics heavily like politics, religion, and this new album, Therapy. Welcome to the show, K. How are you this Saturday? I'm good. Thanks for being here tonight. Thanks for having me. Well, I'm not real familiar with your music, actually. Enlighten our listeners on who you are. Gladly, G. Well, I started writing lyrics back in 83. Doing it as a hobby long before it started paying me. The neighborhood where we hang, we rap and let the beats bang. And what is SPC? Some kind of street gang? Nah, man, we ain't no gang. We just a rap group. So if I got loud and pushed you, I'd probably slap so you. So you condone violence? Depends on the scenario. Mainly self-defense, disrespect. That's anywhere you go. But on the cool, why you ask the silly questions, dude? I'm just trying to get an understanding. But your questions are rude. I know that alcohol and drugs rappers use a lot. How many times have you been shot? What? How many tattoos you got? Neither 
one, all that stuff is a stereotype. False media hype made for tricking and scaring your wife. You say it's hype, but I have to disagree with you. How come you rappers always blame your image on the media? Well, the things that they let people know go much deeper, bro. They only show the bad side with a motive to deceive the whole. Lies and propaganda feed the soul and folks believe what's told. And how many TV and radio networks do we control? Now you blame the corporate powers, wow, that seems absurd. Damn straight, they the ones who dictate what's seen and heard. Let me apologize to listeners hearing these lies. I get it, you must be one of those conspiracy guys who think the government's the reason streets are filled with crap. They plotted war to steal Iraq and police want to kill the blacks. That was good, you made my job easy, that was real exact. But everything you're trying to joke about can be revealed with facts. A million stats, yeah, the system's still running scams while we sit at home watching Mario and Bill Cunningham. I represent the media, allow me to respond. Man, you host a little radio show, you just a peon A feed of fish in a large pond trying to copy them Wishing you could be on CNN with O'Reilly now So what about the black on black crime, the disunity The sex and drugs you rappers like to glorify musically Well, it's a lot of rap songs that I don't condone That's what you say, but you got some dirty songs of your own Yeah, I made a lot of bad songs back in the day Now I watch what I say, cause it ain't wise to be rapping that way But why you thinking you revealing something major? You looking like a fool, my fans know my whole Oh, history player, I see they done it all, the good, bad, the ugly, so I rap about my flaws to help others, that's why they love me. Well, I hear you okay, but on another note, you seem to be dissatisfied with government, do you vote? <laughs> Vote for what? Vote for who? Be for real. Though I wouldn't discourage nobody from voting if that's how they feel. If that's your choice, make it happen. I ain't stopping you. Do it because it reflects your best interest, not because it's popular. Can we talk about racism? Yeah, let's get it popping. Your lyrics spew a lot of Nation of Islam doctrine. Yeah, 